What is going on comic book and collectibles community? This is the Flash by Night channel. That is a Funko Pop and I have got a story to tell. Welcome back comic book community and collectibles community. Um, I am back once again to tell you one of my stories of collecting but this time it's not collecting comic books it is funko pops now if you can look in the background you can see my one funko pop i'm not a pop collector um because i don't need another rabbit hole basically uh if i get one or get to uh by the way the one behind me was given to me by a friend of mine the uh flash by night silent benefactor if you will but if I if I buy one or two, I'm going to end up with five, I'm gonna end up with 10, 15, 20, so on and so forth. And I don't need another rabbit hole. But I'm going to tell you about my very first Funko Pop, and it was not that one. So today uh, I was in the not so bland office, you know, doing my work and a couple of the IT guys stopped by. And you know, they came in and they were asking about my work phone, wanted to make some updates, see if I had some settings right. Um, and then one of them noticed my uh, my meager, my meager, humble setup as a comic book reader and nerd in my office. And so we started talking about comics and collectibles and um, of course, we made it around to Funko Pops. And he asked me if I collected Funko Pops. And I told him, no, I had, uh, I've only had two in my lifetime. One is the Arachnite back there. And another is a pop that I first got back in maybe 2012, 2013. I didn't give it a lot of thought um, because I didn't know what a Funko Pop was back then. It was a, it was this new thing. It came in a box. And so I took it out of the box because I wanted to see it. And lo and behold, you've got Lil Bane here. Lil Bane is from the Dark Knight's Return movie. And yes, I did want to do the Bane voice, but my Bane voice isn't that great. But we've got Lil Bane here. And of course, you see Lil Bane is outside of his box. Uh, Lil Bane is kind of scratched up, if you can see at the top of his head. I've let a uh, couple of kids play with it, including my goddaughter. Lil Bane's head has been turned around a few times. Lil Bane is not in near mint condition. We will say that uh, graciously. But what I did not know about Lil Bane until today is that if Lil Bane had stayed in his box, if I knew Funko's were going to be a collectible item or maybe were even a collectible item and I didn't know uh little bane would be worth a hundred and sixty dollars that's right I have a hundred and sixty dollar Funko Pop and I took it out of the box and I played with it and I kicked it around on the ground okay maybe not that much but I had no clue what I had in my hand when I held this uh, tiny piece of gold. So Little Bane now is just Little Bane. He just hangs around the house, uh, but he is not of any monetary value, which I may may or may not have sold anyway, because the same friend that bought me the Wreck Knight also bought Little Bane. Uh, as I said, the silent benefactor of the Flash by Night channel. And so that's where we are. I uh, basically opened and let's say for monetary reasons, ruined a $160 Funko Pop. Uh, but I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one. So if you have a story about a collectible that you didn't know was a collectible or a collectible you didn't value. And so maybe it's a comic and you kind of folded it in half and put it in your back pocket one day. Or um, I don't know. Maybe it's a old game that you threw away and then now you notice that old Nintendo games are worth money. 
whatever it is, if you have a collectible that you did something to that you lost, uh, but now you know the value of it, put it in the contents. Go ahead and share with the community. Um, as always, I tell these stories so I can share with you because all you can do is laugh at some of these things. They're, they're, they're not to be upset with. Um, you know, once, once, once things happen, they're in the past. The past is the past. You can't change it. You can learn from it. And so me and Lil Bane are going to go about our merry way, go about our day. But if you have a Lil Bane story, I would love for you to share it with the community. That being said, I am TJ, a.k.a. Flash by Night. And you know how we do things. Love yourself. Love others. Take care of your collectibles. And I will be back in a flash.